Good morning. Hi. To further protect your skin and prevent any, any pressure sores forming on the bottom of your heels, we're going to put some waffle boots on you. And the waffle boots have air redistribution capabilities just like the mattress you're lying on. I got the right size because I measured your calf first and then picked the appropriate waffle boot to fit you. When I put these on you, there are straps to hold it in place so your legs won't shift. There is a cotton lining on the inside that usually feels pretty cool to the foot. You drop your foot in here. Make sure that the heel is still floating off of the mattress for pressure ulcer prevention. An alternative is that we can take a pillowcase and line the inside of the waffle boot with a pillowcase. There is an optional safety strap, but if it would make you feel uncomfortable, I can leave it open. I want to check on the bottom to make sure that your heel is actually floating. Every shift, the nurses are going to check to make sure that the boots are fitting you adequately. So they will put their hands inside, underneath the straps to make sure they're not rubbing. And they're going to feel underneath to see if your heel is truly still floating. Hi. Another product that we can use is called a heel elevator. The heel elevator comes in one size and it fits most people so I do not have to measure your calf for it. I put it on you the same way that we put on the waffle boot. Slide your foot in there, make sure your heel is properly elevated off of the bottom. Secure the straps and do the same hand checks to make sure that it is fitting you properly. If you have a patient who is agitated and moving their foot a great deal, you can take the boot off, remove the bottom strap, attach the tongue to the inside, and then replace the boot so prevent them from digging their heel into the bed.